Hi everybody, Todd Martin here and another Practical Success Principle topic today is stepping out of your comfort zone, three strategies. So just real quickly, um, there are those of you out there that uh, are just the kind of people that uh, when you try something new, you don't wait, you don't look around, you just jump in. Like uh, the first time you go to the lake or river um, that year, you know, don't, don't test the water, don't see what temperature it is, just jump right in and you'll figure it out soon enough. So um, did that a few times growing up. And uh, sometimes the water was a little colder than I was expecting. But number two, if you're a little bit more cautious, you may want to spend a little bit of time and orient yourself. So for instance, if you want to learn, um, you want to go do ballroom dancing, maybe the place isn't to start in a fancy ballroom dance where everybody knows how to dance. Um, you just get in everybody else's way and end up looking like a fool, right? So instead of doing that, maybe you go online and you uh, watch some videos and, and see some uh, you know, instructional videos online and then even practice that at home. Secondly, you may uh, go and find out if the local rec center or Elks Club or someplace like that may be doing some classes on ballroom dancing and go, you know, go ahead and sign up and take those. And what you're doing is preparing yourself for it for to go out and to to go uh, ballroom dancing so that's that's a second way to do it most of us but don't delay engage that and make it happen rather than using it as an excuse to not engage the uh, process and stepping out of your comfort zone into that new activity but i always find that helpful myself because i know you know the overwhelmingness of uh, uh you know life's so busy and starting a new uh, skill or a new area or a new project can just seem um, uh, you know, keep me paralyzed basically and not moving ahead. So just spending a little time orienting myself to what that project's going to look like, feel like, what I'm going to have to do is helpful to get me moving. And number three, don't overthink it. Don't sit and analyze and what about this and that and all the things you don't, can't, you know, you're trying to imagine that you don't know yet. We can allow that to paralyze us. So don't spend your time overthinking, take action jump in or probably better do something to orient yourself to the project or task or that you want to engage that is out of your comfort zone and that'll help you ease into that but once you've uh, once you've done that don't uh, procrastinate go ahead and get involved and take it to the next stage because most of us frankly learn better by by doing and being involved uh, rather than just watching a video or something like that online all right i hope this these tips were helpful and as always, don't wait for it to happen. Go out and make it a great day.